Hey guys, Nathan, Nathan's Automotive, proud supporter of Noble Athletics. We work on all makes and models specializing in diesel engine repairs. I'm so proud to show our support for the Noble Public Schools through our unique Auto Repairs for Bears program. Bring your car in for maintenance or repair and drop those repair receipts off at any school campus and Nathan's will give back 5% of the totals to the Noble Public School System. We're looking forward to serving you for all your automotive needs. Go Bears! Support your school's booster club and get your business in front of thousands of potential customers. Talk about a win-win. Advertising packages start on this streaming station for less than $10 a game. Call 405-726-0835 or email adam at squirtle.com right now for more information. What would you do if you only had one life to live? Well, that's kind of how this whole thing works. So bite off more than you can chew. Don't wait for someone else's green light. Go after what they say you can't. Oklahoma needs more doers, and doers don't wait. Get skilled, get paid. Oklahoma Career Tech. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is John Stokes. We're bringing you live footage of the regional first round with your noble lady bears. Coming from the home of the fighting Irish, Bishop McGinnis, noble will be taking on Guyman. <coughs> Just started warm ups. Trying to make sure we can get you guys a good signal. If you're just joining us, this is the warm-up before the first round of regionals. Noble will be taking on Guyman. This is the first year in a while that uh, Noble's coming in ranked. They've got a young team, but they're doing a great job this year. This is Coach Hannah Hickson's first year as head coach. Nicole Powell is assisting. They've got a pretty young team. Really sophomore heavy. Got four seniors on the team. A couple of freshmen. Hickey showing off with a hit there. We're live with NobleBears.tv. We're going to step away. We'll be back for the lineups.
it time for your school or business to purchase a new phone system? Give the experts at Versatile Networks a call. In most cases, we can provide a phone system with brand new phones for less than your current monthly bill. Call us for a free quote today. high school streaming service scordle.tv find out more at scordle.com slash stream at maples nixon diesel horse we've helped a lot of people and our goal was to treat each and every person like a friend and as a friend we've got your back always we understand what you're going through being lawyers is what we do but it's not all that we are we care We'll stand beside you throughout the entire legal process, not just as lawyers, but as your friends. We are Maples Nicks and Diesel Horst, and we are here to help. The AMG team is based in Oklahoma City and delivers your organization revenue enhancement through a combination of data science, innovative marketing, and business automation. We think like owners and behave as long-term partners. Delivering measurable results for nearly 20 years has made the AMG team known for our ability to efficiently and effectively execute objectives. We are ready to help raise your organization to a higher level of success, so visit us today at theamgteam.com. Dr. Matt Dieselhorst at Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics can help you get game day ready. Dr. Dieselhorst works with athletes of all ages, taking a coordinated approach to accelerate return to play and maximize athletic performance. His work with pros in sports training, injury prevention, bracing, functional rehabilitation and imaging works seamlessly with his medical and surgical expertise. Get started by going to Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics. Let Dr. Matt Dieselhorst get you back on the field. Backing all Oklahoma athletes on the field and uh hey guys nathan nathan's automotive proud supporter of noble athletics we work on all makes and models specializing in diesel engine repairs i'm so proud to show our support for the noble public schools through our unique auto repairs for bears program bring your car in for maintenance or repair and drop those repair receipts off at any school campus and Nathan's will give back 5% of the totals to the Noble Public School System. We're looking forward to serving you for all your automotive needs. Go Bears! Support your school's booster club and get your business in front of thousands of potential customers. Talk about a win-win. Advertising packages start on this streaming station for less than $10 a game. Call 405-726-0835 or email adam at squirtle.com right now for more information. What would you do if you only had one life to live? Well, that's kind of how this whole thing works. So bite off more than you can chew. Don't wait for someone else's green light. Go after what they say you can't. Oklahoma needs more doers, and doers don't wait. Get skilled, get paid. Oklahoma Career Tech. time for your school or business to purchase a new phone system? Give the experts at Versatile Networks a call. In most cases, we can provide a phone system with brand new phones for less than your current monthly bill. Call us for a free quote today. Oklahoma's 
number one high school streaming service, Scordle.tv. Find out more at Scordle.com slash stream. At Maples Nixon Diesel Horse, we've helped a lot of people, and our goal was to treat each and every person like a friend. And as a friend, we've got your back, always. We understand what you're going through. Being lawyers is what we do, but it's not all that we are. We care. We'll stand beside you throughout the entire legal process, not just as lawyers, but as your friends. We are Maples Nicks and Diesel Horst, and we are here to help. The AMG team is based in Oklahoma City and delivers your organization revenue enhancement through a combination of data science, innovative marketing, and business automation. We think like owners and behave as long-term partners. Delivering measurable results for nearly 20 years has made the AMG team known for our ability to efficiently and effectively execute objectives. We are ready to help raise your organization to a higher level of success, so visit us today at theamgteam.com. Dr. Matt Dieselhorst at Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics can help you get game day ready. Dr. Dieselhorst works with athletes of all ages, taking a coordinated approach to accelerate return to play and maximize athletic performance. His work with pros in sports training, injury prevention, bracing, functional rehabilitation and imaging works seamlessly with his medical and surgical expertise. Get started by going to Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics. Let Dr. Matt Dieselhorst get you back on the field. Backing all Oklahoma athletes on the field and off. Hey guys, Nathan, Nathan's Automotive, proud supporter of Noble Athletics. We work on all makes and models specializing in diesel engine repairs. I'm so proud to show our support for the Noble Public Schools through our unique Auto Repairs for Bears program. Bring your car in for maintenance or repair and drop those repair receipts off at any school campus and Nathan's will give back 5% of the totals to the Noble Public School System. We're looking forward to serving you for all your automotive needs. Go Bears! Support your school's booster club and get your business in front of thousands of potential customers. Talk about a win-win. Advertising packages start on this streaming station for less than $10 a game. Call 405-726-0835 or email adam at squirtle.com right now for more information. What would you do if you only had one life to live? Well, that's kind of how this whole thing works. So bite off more than you can chew. Don't wait for someone else's green light. Go after what they say you can't. Oklahoma needs more doers, and doers don't wait. Get skilled, get paid. Oklahoma Career Tech. school or business to purchase a new phone system? We're back with NovaBears.tv. We are uh, getting ready for the introductions here. National Anthem will be played. Guyman introducing their players. Guyman's roster includes Elizabeth Drigo, number five, Catherine Zavalza, number seven, Juliet Gandara, number eight, Melanie Alv Alvitarez, number nine, Denara Guevara, number 10, Anna Chavez, number 11, Tazia Watson, number 13, Claire Furnish, number 14, Yolette Gandara, number 17, Mia Jimenez, number 21, Julie Garcia, number 22, Hayden Butler, number 23, 
Aliyah Byers, number 26, Erica Gonzalez, and number 44, Mia Contreras. Nobles lineup. Number one, Libero Junior Bree Washburn. Number two, freshman Lexi Guys. Number three, junior Matty Gray. Number four, senior Lindley Hickey. Number five, senior Araceli Martinez. Number six, sophomore Taylor Mallory. Number seven, number sophomore, number seven, Macy Berry. Sophomore, number nine, Cody Duncan. Freshman, number 10, Lane Usler. Junior, number 12, Cameron Sterling. Junior, number 13, Jayla Thompson. Sophomore, number 17, Kaysen Cottrell. Senior, number 22, Macy Barefoot. Sophomore, number 23, Elsie Matlock. And senior, number 25, Casey Graves. Your Lady Bears are coached by Hannah Hickson and assisted by Nicole Powell. Noble Bears come into this rank number 16 in 5A. Um, it's the first time in a while they've been ranked that high. First time we could find that they came into this regional game as a ranked team since uh, the 1960s when Noble actually won a state title. Uh, a little bit of trivia for you there. In the 60s, Noble won a state title. Coach Ferris was the coach and uh, had uh, quite a team back then. That was even before my time, as old as I am. These girls certainly don't remember that, and they would like to make a statement here today against Guyman. Getting ready to get the uh, rotation checked, and the game will get underway. The uh, Fighting Irish, their gym is not real wide, so our camera shot cannot quite get the entire court, but we got as much of it as we possibly could. We'll be bringing you all the action that we possibly can. Looking over stats and records, these teams are pretty evenly matched, so we should be in for a good game. Of course, on our side, we're hoping Noble is able to come out with the win today. Get past this first round game of regionals. Quite an accomplishment for the young team that we have right now. You got two seniors on the court right now, Lindley Hickey and uh, Macy Barefoot. Cody Duncan, Jayla Thompson, Macy Berry, and Maddie Gray will be out here for your first rotation. There's your libero, Bree Washburn, checking in. Get this thing started. Noble will have the serve. Macy Berry back to serve. Was looking at some stats. She has an awesome serving percentage. There's an ace by Macy. She starts it off nice for the Lady Bears. That'll be one nothing, Lady Bears. Guyman will get the point off the return. That'll put us at one one. Guyman will have the serve. That serve goes into the net. That was Erica Gonzalez with the net serve. That'll give the Bears another point. Macy Barefoot back to serve for the Bears. Hickey with a kill, too hard to handle. That'll give the Bears the lead, three to one. Ooh, Cody Duncan with a kill shot. To the back corner. Bears are pumped up. That'll be 4-1. 
Bears with the lead, barefoot back to serve again. Nice serve back to the libero. Guyman gets to hit the fall. That'll be a point for them. Noble leads 4-2. Guyman back to serve. Cody Duncan pops one over into the middle. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears lead 5-2. Cody Duncan with a jump serve. Serves it deep. Lindley Heakey with a block. That'll score one for the Bears. Bears will take a 6-2 lead. Cody Duncan, mm, serve goes a little wide. That'll be out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Lexi Guys. In for the Bears. Serve was a little too much to handle. That'll be an ace for Guyman. They'll score a point. Be 6 4 Bears. Mia Jimenez back to serve. Cottrell drops one down. That'll be a point for the Bears. Jayla Thompson with a serve. Hickey gets a tricky one back over the net. Bears with a free ball back over. Tazia Watson with the kill against the Bears. Guyman will score the point. That'll make it 7-5, Bears. Guyman will go back to serve. Hayden Butler be serving for the Tigers. Bree Washburn with the pass. Macy Berry gets the kill. That'll be another point for Noble. They'll, take the, they'll keep the lead 8-5. Hickey back to serve. There's a tip. Got a pass in the set. Barefoot tips one over and scores a point. That'll be a point for the Bears. They'll go up 9-5. Hickey back to serve. Good serve. Cottrell with a pass. Barry with a kill shot up into the bleachers. What a shot. We got a timeout, Guyman. Bears lead 10-5. You're at Noble Bears TV. We will take a small break. And we'll be right back with the action after this timeout. Give the experts at Versatile Networks a call. In most cases, we can provide a phone system with brand new phones for less than your current monthly bill. Call us for a free quote today. number one high school streaming service, Scordle.tv. Find out more at scordle.com slash stream. And we're back. Lexi gets her hands on that ball would have been out of bounds but she touches it so that'll be a point for the Tigers Bears still lead 
Back to serve for the Tigers, number 11, Tazia Watson. She'll get an ace. That'll score one for the Tigers. Taylor Mallory just not quite able to get to that one. Bears able to get control and free it over. That hits short. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears up 11-7. Matty Gray coming in, going back to serve. Cody Duncan also in for the Bears. Duncan having a good year. Quite a few kills on the season. Gray with a good serve. Barry gets a touch on it. Hey, Bears come away with a point on that one. That'll be another point for the Bears. They're up 12-7 in the first set. Oh, Macy Barry puts one down. Nice block. That'll be another point for the Bears. Matty Gray back to serve. Good save there by Taylor Mallory. Maddie Gray frees one over. Taylor Mallory unable to get to the ball. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Bears lead 13-8 in this first set. Washburn with a great dig. She'll free one back over. Guyman will have a chance here. There's a tip. Pass. Oh, nice. The ball called out of bounds, hit the antenna. That'll be a point for Guyman. Bear is able to get it over, barely. Matty Gray with a dig. Bree Washburn with a killer free ball. That'll put the Bears up 14-9. That'll put us back in rotation one. Macy Berry back to serve. Jayla Thompson back in on the front line. Serve crawls over the net. Ball goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. Barry back to serve. Macy Barefoot just puts it in a hole. Able to score the point for the Bears. Bears up 16-9. We got a timeout by the Tigers. You're watching NobleBears.tv. We'll be back. Right after this. At Maples Nixon Diesel Horse, we've helped a lot of people. And our goal was to treat each and every person like a friend. And as a friend, we've got your back always. We understand what you're going through. Being lawyers is what we do, but it's not all that we are. We care. We'll stand beside you throughout the entire legal process. Not just as lawyers, but as your friends. We are Maples Nixon Diesel Horse, and we are here to help. The AMG team is based in Oklahoma City and delivers your organization revenue enhancement through a combination of data science, innovative marketing, and business automation. We think like owners and behave as long-term partners. Delivering measurable results for nearly 20 years has made the AMG team known for our ability to efficiently and effectively execute objectives. We're ready. We're back from the timeout. Macy Berry wastes no time. She gets the ace and the point for the Bears. That puts the Bears up 17-9 in this first set. Bears have great momentum. Berry with a serve. Oh, that'll be an ace. Serves that ball deep. It was just hard to handle. 
Bears will go up 18 to 9. Barry back to serve. That's a rear net serve by Macy. Macy's serving percentage is at a 95.6. That's a great percentage. That's why she leads off. Now we got serving for the Tigers, Erica Gonzalez. She puts one deep. Barefoot, able to keep it over on the other side of the net. Barefoot with a hit. They have to dig it out. Maddie Gray with a dig. Cody Duncan with a kill shot. That'll be 19-10 for the Bears. Barefoot puts her serve over. Nice set. Hickey's hit goes long. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Back to serve, number 13, Claire Furnish. Bears have to free it over. The tip by Guyman. That hit goes long. Bears had to play most of that one out of system, but they were able to come away with a point. Cottrell checks in. Cody Duncan back to serve. Nice, hard, flat serve by Duncan. Free Washburn able to get that ball up. It just didn't go to anyone. We're unable to connect there, and that'll be a point for the Tigers. Bears lead 20-12. to 12. Bears free it over. That hit goes out of bounds. that would be a point for the Bears. The hit was by Tazia Watson. She's got quite a swing on her. Got to watch it when she's got that under control. Jayla Thompson in now to serve. Serve goes deep. That'll be out of bounds. That'll be a point for Guyman. Be 21-13, Bears. Hayden Butler in to serve. Catherine Zavalza also checking in for the Tigers. Barry with a pass. Macy Barry with a nice hit. Guyman able to handle it. They get it up. Barry able to score on a, on a tip. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears will be 22-13. Back to serve, Lindley Hickey. Hickey puts the ball in play. Watson's hit is short. Goes into the net. That'll be a point for the Bears. Hickey back to serve again. Bears looking pretty solid in this first set. Nice pass by Lexi Guys. Barry with a nice hit. There's what I was talking about. Watson's hit. When she connects, it's, it's hard to handle. She'll score one for the Tigers. It'll be 23-14. Bears, Watson back to serve. Guyman being aggressive on that one, trying to score the point. They'll hit the ball into the antenna. That'll be out of bounds. That'll bring us a set point for Bears. Up 24-14. Maddie Gray back to serve.
Barry with the kill. That'll be set number one. They'll take the first set, 25-14. Bears will take that first set. Bears looking pretty solid today. They go out there with a great attitude, stayed aggressive. They seem to play their best ball when they are aggressive and going after the points, when they get back on their heels, they have a little bit of a hard time, but they were able to stay on top of things here and walk away with the first set. We've got about two minutes before the next set starts. This is noblebears.tv. To help raise your organization to a higher level of success. So visit us today at theamgteam.com. Dr. Matt Dieselhorst at Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics can help you get game day ready. Dr. Dieselhorst works with athletes of all ages, taking a coordinated approach to accelerate return to play and maximize athletic performance. His work with pros in sports training, injury prevention, bracing, functional rehabilitation and imaging works seamlessly with his medical and surgical expertise. Get started by going to Dieselhorst Sports and Orthopedics. Let Dr. Matt Dieselhorst get you back on the field. Backing all Oklahoma athletes on the field and off. Hey guys, Nathan, Nathan's Automotive, proud supporter of Noble Athletics. We work on all makes and models specializing in diesel engine repairs. I'm so proud to show our support for the Noble Public Schools through our unique Auto Repairs for Bears program. Bring your car in for maintenance or repair and drop those repair receipts off at any school campus and Nathan's will give back 5% of the totals to the Noble Public School System. We're looking forward to serving you for all your automotive needs. Go Bears! Support your school. And we're back. Second set, getting ready to start. I'm John Stokes. This is NobleBears.tv. Bringing you first round regionals action. Lady Bears take the first set. 25-14, they're into the second set. Bears able to bring that one back over. Ball goes out of bounds off the block. Guyman will start off with the score. They'll take the lead 1-0. Erica Gonzalez serving for the Tigers. Bears punch one over. Got to get back on the aggressive side. Just tipping the ball over and freeing it. Barry with the tip. Got a long rally going here. Washburn reaches up and get a hand on that one. Would have been out of bounds, but instead it results in a point for the Tigers. They'll take a lead in this second set, 2-0. Gray digs a good one. Macy Berry hits one that's hard to handle. The Bears will walk away with a point. That's what we needed, get that ball back. Jayla Thompson coming in. For the Bears, back to serve. Number seven, Macy Berry. Started off with an ace last time. Let's see that happen again. It does. Another ace by Macy Berry. Her serving percentage is over 95%. We like to see her behind the line. It normally means points for the Bears. 
There we go. There's another one. And with that ace, that'll give the Bears the lead. Barry back. She's going to try to make this three in a row. Oh, she gets one to roll over. That's another ace by Macy Berry. And we got a timeout by the Tigers. Bears lead four to two. Bears leading this second set, four to two. One thing about this gym, we're in, we're in the small gym, not the main gym, and it is loud uh, in here. They, these parents are getting excited. These fans are getting excited on these plays, and it's a great atmosphere to be playing in. Here we go, back to action. Macy Berry back to serve. Bears lead four two. Ah, that that one goes into the net. That'll be point for the Tigers. Claire Furnish back to serve for Guyman. Barry not able to handle that serve. That'll result in a point for the Tigers, and that'll tie it up. For all here in the second set. There's a net serve. That'll be a point for the Bears. Lindley Hickey coming into the game. Barefoot back to serve. Hickey takes kind of a wild swing at that ball, puts it out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Be tied up at five. Mia Jimenez back to serve. She'll score the ace there. That'll be a point for Guyman. They'll take their first lead of the day. They'll lead this second set 6-5. That'll be a net serve. All tied up, Cody Duncan will go back to serve. Cottrell checking in for the Bears. Cody Duncan with the ace. Ball's just too hard to handle. That'll put the Bears back in the lead. Lady Bears back to serve, hoping to uh, extend this lead a little bit here. Duncan puts it into the net. That'll be a point for the Tigers. All tied up. Lexi Guy's coming in as a defensive specialist. She's a freshman player. Showing great potential this year. Making it on the varsity team. Great pass there off the serve. Lindley Hickey with a hard hit. Would have been a kill, but we had a net violation called against the Tigers. Either way, it results in a point for the Bears, and they'll take a lead. Jayla Thompson coming back to serve now. Great block there. Puts it back in play. Unable to bring that one back up, though. That'll be a point for the Tigers. It's all tied up at eight. Bears looking to uh, get back on top again here. Washburn, great pass. Macy Berry, solid hit. They, they shanked that one up into the bleachers here. 
That'll result in a point for the Bears. Bears will take the lead again. Back to serve. It's Hickey time. That was a double that was called. I was wondering if they were going to call that or not. They did. That'll result in a point for the Bears. They'll go up 10-8. Finally, a little bit of a cushion there. High pass, high set. Just a bad, just a bad decision there. They had two, two saves to get that ball in the court, and we should have just freed it over. Instead, we try to hit on it. I like, I like being aggressive, but sometimes you got to be smart on those plays. That one didn't quite work out. That'll give Guyman another point. They'll be back to serve. Lexi Guys with a good pass off a hard serve. Barefoot decides to tip it over. Guys with another good pass. Barry with the kill coming into this game. Barry had, uh, trying to look here, 42 kills coming into this game. She, she leads the team in kills and kill percentage. Just having a great year this year. Maddie Gray with a serve. That hit goes nowhere. That'll be another point for the Bears. Bears now lead 12-9 over the Tigers. Great hit by Barry. She'll get another kill on that one. That'll be a point for the Bears. They're doing a great job. Bears starting to pull away a little bit. After playing neck and neck, it's 13-9. Maddie Gray with a serve. Not quite enough on that one. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Tigers making some substitutions. Back to serve for the Tigers is number 26, Erica Gonzalez. She's their first server, so they'll be back in rotation one here. That's going to be out of bounds. Lady Bears wisely let that one go. That'll be a point for the Bears. And we're back in rotation one, which means Macy Berry up to serve. Tigers take a timeout. It'll be a one-minute timeout, and so uh, we'll step away for just a moment. This is NobleBears.tv. Booster Club and get your business in front of thousands of potential customers. Talk about a win-win. Advertising packages start on this streaming station for less than $10 a game. Call 405-726-0835 or email adam at squirtle.com right now for more information. What would you do if you only had one life to live? Well, that's kind of how this whole thing works. So bite off more than you can chew. Don't wait for someone else's green light. Go after what they say you can't. Oklahoma needs more doers, and doers don't wait. Get skilled, get paid. Oklahoma Career Tech. Barry with the serve. She'll hit from the back row. Man, that ball was humming. Goes out of bounds. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. Bears lead 14-11 in this second set. They lead one set to zero over the Tigers. Mm, Thompson's hit. Didn't quite make it over. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Claire Furnish back serving. Bears are going to free this one over. Guyman had a hard time handling it. Got a hand on the block. Able to make something out of it. Jayla Thompson with a hit. Washburn dug that one out. The pass was a little long into the net. 
Couldn't get a hold of it. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Bears lead 14-13. There we go. There's a good pass. There's a dump. Pushes another one over. Got a free ball coming at us. Did not make it over the net. That'll be a point for the Bears. We get the serve back. Barefoot back to serve. Nice serve. Good hard flat serve. They'll just give it to us and let us try again. A little miscommunication on the set there. We tip it back over. We're going to free this one back. We need to get back in the system, set up, and make a play here before they do. Ooh, off the block. Way to get a hand on it, make it possible there. We punch that one over. Here we go. Maddie Gray gets it up. Another free ball. We got to get back on our toes and be aggressive here. That ball goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears have to remember to stay aggressive. It's easy when, you, uh, when you're one up that you uh, start playing a little conservative. That's really not their game. They really need to be playing aggressive. They play the best when they do. Captain on Guyman's side asking the ref a question. Not sure what it was, but we're back under action here. Whoop. Not able to handle that one. So that'll be a point for the Bears. Barefoot back to serve. Bears up 17-13. There's a nice, hard serve. Barry with a pass. Thompson sets it up to Hickey. With the kill. We're going to call that one on the ground. They looked like they might have dug that one out, but ref calls it on the ground. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears will go up 18-13. And we got another timeout by the Tigers. We're going to go ahead and just stay here during this time out. The Bears are looking pretty solid in this set. If uh, you're not used to uh, watching volleyball and you're just tuning in for this regional game, we play a three out of five match, so Bears are already up one set. Getting this second set would be uh, very nice. Have a two set cushion going into that third set. We'll play four sets to 25 if necessary, and if that fifth set needs to come around, that one will only go to 15. We're hoping we don't have to go that far. Barefoot back to serve. Oh, that's an ace. Little miscommunication on Guyman's part there. That'll result in a point. For the Bears, they'll take a 19-13 lead. Coming in, number 23, Aliyah Byers. Maybe Aliyah. Maybe Aliyah Byers for the Tigers. Barefoot with a hard serve. Hickey's pass goes a little long. Guy been able to put that back down on our side. That'll give them a point. Guyman will have the serve. Mia Jimenez. Bears free one over. Guyman trying to set one up. Again, Watson with the hit. That's why it's crucial that we stay on the offensive, not give them free balls. We don't want her hitting the ball at us. There we go, Washburn with a good pass. I think we called a foot fault there. I wasn't looking at the sign. That'll be a point for the Bears, though. Cody Duncan with a jump serve. 
That's what we want to see. Three ball coming our way. Let's get something set up. Thompson with a set. Back row hit to Duncan. Ah, the ball goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Lexi Guys back in as a defensive specialist for the Lady Bears. Guyman will bring in a couple more people, including number 22, Hayden Butler. She'll go back to serve. Just a total miscommunication. Actually, I think they called a double on that one, it looks like. That'll be a point for the Tigers. But we're back to serve. There we go. There's a good pass. Hickey pushes one over. They push one deep in the corner. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. That'll make it a 28 team. Bears try to tip one over. They're going to have to get a hold of it. Get aggressive again. We've let them creep back into it. 2019, Bears. There we go, good pass. Cottrell's hit goes into the net, and that'll tie it up. 20 each. Bears going to have to come alive. Make a stop right here. There we go, guys with a good pass. Cottrell's hit is way too deep. That'll give Guyman a point. Bears need this serve. Gonna have to play some tough defense here. That's what, that's what we don't want to happen. Now we got a timeout, Bears. Coach Hickson's gonna try to get them back under control. We're gonna take a break here on NobleBears.tv. We'll be back right after the timeout. school or business to purchase a new phone system? Give the experts at Versatile Networks a call. In most cases, we can provide a phone system with brand new phones for less than your current monthly bill. Call us for a free quote today. And we're back after the timeout. Guyman leads 22-20 in this second set, but we're back to serve. There's a pass by Barry. Cottrell's hit is good that time. They're able to push one deep on us for the score. Guyman leads 23-20. Butler's been serving way too long. Need to get a stop here. We free one over again. Here we go. Jayla Thompson with the block. That'll be a point for the Bears. Jayla Thompson back to serve. Serves a little hard to handle. Double called on that set. When you're setting the ball, both hands have to hit simultaneously. If you hit one after the another, a double's called. Jayla Thompson serves good.
We just did not have good tip coverage there. We got a set point. Watson back to serve. Bears need to make a stand right here. That hit goes out of bounds, so that'll be a point for the Bears. Hickey back to serve, kind of a crucial serve. Game or set point for the Tigers. Got to win by two. That ball is out of bounds. The ref called it in. Ref called that one in, so that'll be 25-23 after the second set. Tied at one set apiece. Almost felt like the Bears came in just a little overconfident on that second set after uh, winning so handily the first set. They started playing a little bit conservative. Needed to be a little bit more aggressive. Hopefully Coach Hickson's working out all the kinks down there and getting them straightened out for the next set. We'll be going to a third set. We're going to take a break here on noblebears.tv. Oklahoma's number one high school streaming service, Scordle.tv. Find out more at Scordle.com slash stream. At Maples Nixon Diesel Horse, we've helped a lot of people, and our goal was to treat each and every person like a friend. And as a friend, we've got your back always. We understand what you're going through. Being lawyers is what we do, but it's not all that we are. We care. We'll stand beside you throughout the entire legal process, not just as lawyers, but as your friends. We are Maples Nicks and Diesel Horst, and we are here to help. The AMG team is based in Oklahoma City and delivers your organization revenue enhancement through a combination of data science, innovative marketing, and business automation. We think like owners and behave as long-term partners. Delivering measurable results for nearly 20 years has made the AMG team known for our ability to efficiently and effectively execute objectives. We are ready to help raise your organization to a higher level of success, so visit us today at theamgteam.com. Dr. Matt Dieselhorst at Dieselhorst. We're back with third set action. Duncan's hit. Blocked. That'll give Guyman a point. Bears will start off the third set trailing. That hit goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. We're tied up at one. Barefoot back to serve. That serve is short. That'll be a point for the Tigers. 
Claire Furnish back to serve. Hickey with a hit. That's what we want to see, more of that. Just unable to make something happen there. Guyman will get the point. They'll lead 3-1. Bears are going to have to get that fire that they had in the first set back. Hickey puts one down off the block. That'll be a point for the Bears. Cody Duncan back to serve. Jump serve goes deep. It's good, good serve. Bad set on the Tigers. Hickey hits one that's blocked. Able to get it back up in the air, but not able to do anything with it. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. Guyman leads 4-2. Barry unable to handle that serve to be another point for Guyman. Bears will call a timeout, trying to light a fire under them. Going to have to get something going here. Bears very rarely use their entire time in a timeout. Kind of say what they need to say and get back out on the court. That's why we decided to stay right here with the action. Jimenez back to serve. Cottrell hits one cross court. Watson with a tip. Thompson ready for it that time. That one didn't work out. Jimenez will have the ball. Barry with a pass, good pass. Cottrell with a hit. Too deep. They were asking for a touch on it, but ref said no way. Tigers will have the serve again. Bears are going to have to get one to fall in the court. Guyman up 8-2 in this third set. Washburn with a pass. Thompson puts it back over. Got to get aggressive here. Guyman's just fired up. Bears kind of playing on their heels a little bit. Cottrell comes out. Matlock in for the Bears. A bad pass there. That'll result in a point. For the Tigers, they're up 10 2. Hickey with a hit. They're able to free it back over to us. We've got to watch those long passes. They just keep putting them down on us. Guyman leads 11-2. Bears are going to have to fight their way back on this one. Another tip. Here we go. 
Hey, that push worked. Bears looking to use some momentum. Jayla Thompson back to serve. Bears trail 11-3. That hit is long. Serve goes out of bounds, so that'll be a 12-3 Tigers. Tigers make some substitution. Hayden Butler back to serve. Bad set. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Bears are just going to have to get it together right here. They're playing sloppy. Taylor Mallory checks in for the Bears. Pass the set. Mallory with a hit, and that's going to fall. That'll give the Bears a point. Taylor Mallory has a real good back row attack. That top spin on that ball just kept crawling. Here we go, Hickey to serve. High serve. Oh, they managed to get a hold of it. Get it back over the net. Guyman wasn't quite ready for that. We're just going to free it back over again. Watson with the hit. Macy Barefoot with a big block. They needed that one. That'll put Hickey back to serve. That one doesn't quite work out for the Bears. Watson back to serve. Washburn with the pass. She touched it. Man, that was a bad call right there. They touched it. They touched that ball. It should have been a should have been a new possession right there. Bears kind of get ripped off on that one. There's a good tip. Macy Berry makes a smart decision there. That'll be a point for the Bears. I wish I had those fancy replays that the football games have. I'd go back and show you how that block happened. We should have got that point. Nice serve by Maddie Gray. That'll be a point for the Bears. Maddie Gray with the ace. Nice serve again. That ball goes into the net. So that'll be another point for the Bears. Maddie Gray to serve again. Nice. Same position as the last one. Ready for it that time. Cody Duncan, nice hit. Yeah, stuff block there. Oh, they still got... Called a double on Guyman. That'll be a point for the Bears. Maddie Gray back to serve. One thing about Maddie's serve, she's pretty consistent on it. That ball goes over and goes into play. Washburn with a nice pass. Barefoot dumps it. Mallory with a good pass. Cody Duncan trying to go up for the short set. A little bit of a miscommunication there. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. Bears made a little bit of a run there, though. Kind of etched away at that point. Spread. And we got an ace by Guyman. Their libero, number 21, Jewy Garcia. 
She'll score one for the Tigers. Washburn with a good pass. Macy Berry with a hit. They're able to pull that one out somehow. That set's too long. Got a lift called against the Bears there. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. They're up 18-9. That ball looked out of bounds. Taylor Mallory made a decision to go for it. I'd always rather rather play it than, than watch it hit and it be in bounds, though. So good hustle on her part. Just didn't work out. That serves short. Guyman's up 19-10. We're back to our first server, Macy Berry. Needs some magic to happen right here. Nice serve. Nice serve. They're, they've got it deep. They've got to free it over. Cody Duncan swings away at that one. Gets the kill. That's the way we need to be playing right there. All out. Play aggressive. Go for those kill shots. Barry back to serve again. That was in. Yeah, nice ace there by Barry. That'd be 12 points for the Bears. She'll get the ball, go back to serve again. Nice serve. Duncan. Jumps up to be aggressive and get a hit on that. She just didn't have her shoulders squared enough. Hit the ball out of bounds. That'll put Guyman up 2012. Their first server, Erica Gonzalez, back to serve. Good pass by Macy Berry. There we go. There's a point off that block. That's what happens when you hit the ball hard enough. It's, it's hard to block. You've got to put those blocks down or they're just going to fly out of bounds. Especially when Duncan's swinging away at it. Barefoot with the serve. Serves it deep. Nice serve. Nice block. They're able to come somehow come up with Oh, they called a double. They called a double on that. Wow. That was awful fast to be able to see. I'm going to take his word for it on that one. And another free ball. Nice block there by Thompson. She gets to set there. Pooch one over. Well, it goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. Tigers take a timeout. Bears lead, I mean Bears trail, 15-20 here in this third set. We're going to take a break here at NobleBears.tv. Sports Orthopedics can help you get game day ready. Dr. Diesel Horse works with athletes of all ages, taking a coordinated approach to accelerate return to play and maximize athletic performance. His work with pros in sports training, injury prevention, bracing, functional rehabilitation and imaging works seamlessly with his medical and surgical expertise. Get started by going to Diesel Horse Sports and Orthopedics. Let Dr. Matt Diesel Horse get you back on the field. Backing all Oklahoma athletes on the field and and off. We're back. After that timeout, Noble Trails 15 20 in this third set. We're tied at one set apiece. Barefoot back to serve. We need to get something going here. She drops one in short. We got a net violation called on number 13. That'll result in a point for the Bears. A 
nice. Maddie Gray gets that ball back up after that block. Good push by Hickey. Both teams hustling right here. Hickey with the hit. Yes, she scores off that block. That's a good hit. Good hit. Bears got some momentum finally. Down by three. Barefoot with a serve. A little too much on that one. It goes out of bounds. That'll give Guyman a point. Serving for the Tigers, number 13, Claire Furnish. Bears need this point. Unable to handle that one. That'll give Guyman a point. Furnish back to serve again. 22-17, Tigers. Maddie Gray gets the ball up high. We push it over. They have to do the same thing. Frito, oh, bad communication. Oh, man. We needed that point. They gave it to us, and we just let them have it. Guyman at 23-17. They've got the serve. Bears need to take a stand right here. They need this point. Gray gets it up. Duncan nails it. We like to call those facials. She gets a hold of that one. That's just too much to handle. She'll go back to serve. Good deep serve. They're going to have to free it over to us. We got to make something out of this. Need a good set here to Hiki. Good hit, and that's a kill. That's a point for the Bears. 23-19. Duncan back to serve. All these have to count. Nice serve, deep. That's hard to handle. They get a hand on it. This one's got to go over. They get the free ball here. Cottrell tips it over. We got to keep it out of Watson's hand. We can't let him keep feeding her. That's set point for the Tigers. 24-19 in this third set. They're trying to take a two-set lead. Bears need to stop here. Hickey puts it into the net. They called it in the net instead of a block. That'll result in a win of this set for the Tigers. So Lady Bears now trail two sets to one after a commanding performance in the first set. Seems like they've let uh, the Tigers wake up a little bit. And that'll be... uh, Third set win for the Tigers. Bears have come back from this little break. They need to make something happen in this best out of three matchup. We're going to take a break here at noblebears.tv. We'll be right back with the fourth set right after this. Hey guys, Nathan, Nathan's Automotive, proud supporter of Noble Athletics. We work on all makes and models specializing in diesel engine repairs. I'm so proud to show our support for the Noble Public Schools through our unique Auto Repairs for Bears program. Bring your car in for maintenance or repair and drop those repair receipts off at any school campus and Nathan's will give back 5% of the totals to the Noble Public School System. We're looking forward to serving you for all your automotive needs. Go Bears! 
Support your school's booster club and get your business in front of thousands of potential customers. Talk about a win-win. Advertising packages start on this streaming station for less than $10 a game. Call 405-726-0835 or email adam at squirtle.com right now for more information. What would you do if you only had one life to live? Well, that's kind of how this whole thing works. So bite off more than you can chew. Don't wait for someone else's green light. Go after what they say you can't. Oklahoma needs more doers, and doers don't wait. Get skilled, get paid. Oklahoma Career Tech. school or business to purchase a new phone system give the experts at versatile networks a call in most cases we can provide a phone system with brand new phones for less than your current monthly bill call us for a free quote today we're back here getting ready to start this fourth set coming into this match i told you guys everything we looked at it looked like these two teams were pretty evenly matched that's what we're seeing after two close sets here. Noble ran away with the first set, but the next two, guyman has been able to take. That puts us in a deficit, two sets to one for the Bears. Guyman starts off with an ace. That was a good serve. Not much you could do about that one. We'll just have to watch that coverage on this one. That serve goes out of bounds. That'll give the Bears a point. Give Macy Berry a chance to get up to the line. We need some serves here. Nice serve. They handle it well, though. Nice. Jayla Thompson makes them pay for that long pass. That'll tie it up. Macy Berry back to serve again. Another good hard serve. Tigers unable to connect on that one. That'll be another point for the Bears. Berry back to serve. Nice hard serve. Hard to handle. They've got this ball deep. Have to free it back over to the Bears. Nice hit by Duncan. They dug that one out. There's a tip. Finally. Barefoot called with a net violation. Must have stepped under. That'll result in a point for the Tigers. We're all tied up at three. That'll be a point for the Bears. Wasn't pretty, but it's a point. Barefoot back to serve. Watson gets the kill. That's what we were talking about earlier. Really important for us to stay on the offensive. We do not want the ball being set over to Watson. Just a smart tip there. We've got to start anticipating those.
Net serve. That'll be a point for the Bears. We're tied up at five. Cody Duncan back to serve. Kaysen Cottrell checking in. Double called there. They're really watching that. They've called both teams several times on that. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Hayden Butler back to serve. Good pass by guys. They'll score off the block. Lexi able to get a hand on it and get it up. That was good hustle on her part. Just weren't able to do anything with it after that. We let that one fall. We can't afford to give them points. Here we go. Nice, nice hit. Hickey with a nice hit. We need more of that. Jayla Thompson back to serve. We trail 6-8. Hickey gets a decent hit on it. Washburn unable to handle that hit. That'll be a point for the Tigers. Watson to serve. Eke with a hit. They're able to dig it somehow. Lexi guys with a nice pass there. Barry puts one smart play. That'll result in a point for the Bears. Macy Barry having a good showing today. Made some smart plays and some good hits. Hickey back to serve. Deep free ball there. That was a double. Okay, we'll take the net violation. <laughs> Whichever. As long as we get the point there. Bears looking to go on a run here. Miscommunication for the Tigers there. Two people trying to hit the ball. Results in a net. And a timeout by the Tigers. Lady Bears managed to tie it up in this fourth set. We're all tied up at nine. Bears looking a little bit more aggressive in this set, which is what they need to do. Really got to go after them in this uh, do or die set right here. Guyman looking to win it if they win this set. Bears looking to stay alive force it to a fifth and final set. A pretty evenly matched team. Didn't expect anybody to run away with it. But we sure want to make a good showing here. Looks like we're back at it. Need to keep this run going here. Hickey back to serve. She puts it in play. That's going to be good. A 
We seem to have a hole right there that uh, they're really taking advantage of. Looks like Hickey's down. Maybe rolled an ankle there going for that ball. We're going to take a moment right here on noblebears.tv while the trainer tends to a down player. We'll be right back. Oklahoma's number one high school streaming service, Scordle.tv. Find out more at Scordle.com slash stream. Hiki being taken back to the training room. The trainers will take care of her back there. Bears are going to have to be uh, real careful not to let that get in their head. She is a vital part of this offense, but we're going to have to work without her. Lexi Guys, good pass there. Cottrell puts it over. Somehow they got that to... Not sure how that wasn't a lift, but they got away with it. We got a timeout. Noble Bears. Guyman leads 11-9 over the Bears. Coach Hickson just trying to get her team calmed down. If you have a player go out with an injury, it's hard to not uh, lose your focus. So she's trying to get them focused back in. Let them know, hey, more than takes more than one person to win a volleyball game. And so they've got to go out there and fill in that gap. Play aggressive and keep going after them. Guyman looking to capitalize on it. Bears looking to use this as some motivation to go out there and fight hard. Here we go. Ball goes out of bounds. Lexi Guys follows it to the line, lets it go. That'll result in a point for the Bears. Maddie Gray back to serve. She went on quite a run in the last set. We could use some more of that right now. There we go. There we go. Make something happen. Good. We've got to watch just pushing it up right over the net. We've got to put those deeper. We're just giving them free swings at us there, and we got to watch for that. Back up to the top of the rotation. Erica Gonzalez back to serve. Cody Duncan swings away at that ball, gets it to bounce off the block and go out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. Bears still fighting their way through this. Macy Berry up to serve. There we go. Puts one deep, makes it hard to handle. They free it over, though. Berry with a good pass. Barefoot with a set. Nice hit by Duncan. They free it back over to us. We're going to try that again. Barefoot dumps one over. They put it back. There's a good set to Duncan. Yeah. That'll result in a kill and a point for the Bears. They'll tie it up at 12. Macy Berry back to serve. Nice serve. Good, hard, low, flat serve. They'll, they'll put that one out. That'll result in a point for the Bears. Bears take a lead finally in this fourth set. 
Looking to make a run here. Keep it going. Barry's serve is low. That'll put us at 13 apiece. And back to serve is number 13, Claire Furnish. Hopefully the, all these 13s will be unlucky for the Tigers. That ball falls inbounds off the block. Looks like the 13s might have got us instead of them on that one. Furnish back to serve. Tigers score again. That serve goes out of bounds. That'll be a point for the Bears. Matlock coming in for the injured Hickey. She'll take her place in the rotation. Barefoot back to serve. Nice. Oh, man, I thought that was a good one. A little bit low, though, so that'll be a point for the Tigers. We're going to have to come after them pretty soon here. Jimenez back to serve. Barry with a back row hit. Nice hit. Good dig by the Tigers. Washburn with a good pass there. Good set. Matlock with the hit. Should have been four called or a lift. You should have seen it. <laughs> Referee saying he didn't see it, but he should have saw it because he was looking right at it. Missed that call. Man, tough break for the Bears. They're going to have to settle down here, get back in it. The quick two points for the Tigers. Araceli Martinez in for the Bears. She's a senior. Great utility player for the Bears. Washburn with a good pass. That tip gets us every time. We're going to have to quit freeing it over to them, be aggressive and go after them. We give them a chance, they come after us. We've got to quit giving them chances here. 17 back to serve. We're going to call a timeout here. Try to get their heads back underneath them. Tigers leading 2014. Bears started off with quite a bit of enthusiasm, quite a bit of uh, heart there in that first set, and they've just had trouble getting it going their way since then. Had a few calls that we might not have agreed with, but In the long run there, it's really just, we need to be playing aggressive. We always say you got you to gotta play for the point, not try to save a point. You got to play for the point. We've been on our heels trying to save ourselves a lot instead of going after them. Need to be getting them out of system, making them give us more opportunities to attack the ball. Well, here we go. Number 17, Mia Jimenez back to serve again. Washburn with a good pass set by Thompson. That hit just goes in the net. A little late on that swing. Just did not make a good connection. We got to have a point here. We got to stop this. Good pass. Watson with the block. Yeah. 
There we go. Good tip. Twenty-two fifteen Tigers. Cody Duncan back to serve. Kaysen Cottrell checking into the game. We need to make a run right here. Good serve. This will give us an opportunity if we can get a hold of it. Good job. They're unable to get the ball back over the net. That'll be a point for the Bears. Duncan back to serve again. That's the end. Nice serve. Good ace by Duncan. Bears trying to stay alive here. They put it deep again. Going for a back row attack here. Good pass by Barry. And Duncan's hit goes out of bounds. That would be a point for the Tigers. Noble trails 17-23. Hickey checking back in. For the Bears, good to see her back on the court. Senior year, regionals. You don't want to see her go out with an injury. She's coming in. We're going to try to make something happen here. Lexi with a good pass. Hickey's hits blocked. That'll be set point for the Tigers. It'll be match point. Match point for the Tigers. Bears need to make a stop right here. We need to get this ball. Hickey with a hit. Nice. Thompson box it, puts it back over. There we go. There's a point for the Bears. Bears still alive now. Still match point for the Tigers. Dang it. That's it. Guyman wins 25-18. They'll take it three sets to one. Lady Bears having to go down with a loss here. Nothing to hang their heads about, though, man. They had a great season. They worked hard. We're going to see some tears out there, but... I really couldn't be more proud of this team. They've done a great job all season. They've worked really hard. The young team, just a lot of growth to be had. And uh, we're looking forward to the future here. Noble Bears having a winning season, which is always good. Going out ranked number 16th in the state in 5A. A lot of good things to be said. Of course, it's not the way we wanted to go home this afternoon, but I think the future looks bright for your Lady Bears. Hey, I'm John Stokes. I appreciate you tuning in to noblebears.tv. Hopefully, we'll be streaming more of our away games next year, and uh, we look forward to being here with you for that. We're going to call it a day on noblebears.tv. Have a good evening, and as always, go Bears! At Maple's Nixon Diesel Horse, we've helped a lot of people, and our goal was to treat each and every person like a friend. And as a friend, we've got your back, always. We understand what you're going through. Being lawyers is what we do, but it's not all that we are. We care. We'll stand beside you throughout the entire legal process, not just as lawyers, but as your friends. We are Maples, Nicks, and Diesel Horst, and we are here to help. The AMG team is based in Oklahoma City and delivers your